okay here is this fresh water generator you can see this is the fresh water generator this is later this and now another part you see this one if you remove this cover this back cover then you will find like this structure that this is the condenser plate this is the evaporator side condenser side evaporator side and before taking out this plate we have to ensure we have to measure how much distance this one with the help of roller this side this side bottom side and this side see people see people writing over here 42 something something so this they have already measured before opening because uh, after assembly they have uh, means we have to tie it at least this much of value okay next one is See this is the cover which, has, which we have removed and this is the demister part, this one is demister, I will tell you function later. You see after removing this cover you will find like this type of plate structure, this is the last plate. You see over here these are the three items 1, 2 and 3, what does it indicate? See this is the relief valve, this one is the vacuum gauge and this one is your temperature gauge you see this one temperature gauge relief one because as you know water is incompressible so definitely there will, there will be some safety arrangement so there has to be some safety arrangement so this is the safety arrangement and this is your measuring for vacuum see this is your front view this one is the sea water inlet line and this one is the sea water outlet and this one is the fresh water production line ok and you see there also one line this is for eductor line connected to eductor and overboard this is the side view you see sea water inlet fresh water production line this going to distillate pump and this is sea water outlet see from outlet there is a feed water line this going to your evaporator side this I will explain later see this is the last plate this is the second last plate now I will tell you one important thing you have to assemble in the correct manner otherwise i have seen people that they assemble in a wrong way so this lack of concept so please we will assemble it in the correct way for the betterment of the machinery anyway okay now you see this is last plate second last and third last so now i will tell you with help of manual how we will ensure that we are assembling in the right way you see this k part E part this one is the condenser this one is the evaporator now we are dealing with the condenser so we will take condenser side this already removed after measurement so this is the last plate you see this view and this view you compare you see inward you see KD after this one second last plate you see second last plate this side see third last plate KV like this is structure you see like this one now i will tell you see this one is the your this one k is the last plate okay and then every alternate plate we have, we have repetition kd kv kd kv will repeat itself and then at last ks means this is our first plate which which is going to touch this fresh water generator body okay See, this is the first plate going to touch fresh water generator body. See this structure and compare with this one outward, correct? So, this one is the wrong, this one is the wrong arrangement that I want to say to you. You see over here, this guy is showing outward, correct? And you see this inward, this is wrong. So, you have to put other way around. So never confuse. You understand what I am telling. Because this is sea water inlet. So definitely this will go this side. Okay. And now there are various holes. See this is the hole. See this is the hole. This is sea water inlet water outlet and see this is the fresh water production side ok c 
see over here you can see very easily inlet fresh water production and see this one is for drive for reductor means fresh water over production this is the, if you suppose don't start fresh water pump so definitely there will be production of fresh water because you see jacket water is circulating sea water is circulating so definitely there will be evaporation condensation and fresh water will be produced so this over thing will go from here as we can say first five minutes you taste fresh water depends upon ppm it's good then you can start filling your tank okay see this line this line duct line see this going to duct over board and this one your fresh water production line going to distillate pump and from here distillate production to from it is this one fresh water tanks see now this is the most important part i have seen people often confuse they have write 1 2 3 4 some numbering so they don't mess out with the things but there is no need to put number if you feel concept is right alternate put no problem you see this is from here from evaporator sea water evaporate and through demister coming up 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 and from again sea water flowing from here and here on back side of this plate and here there is no obstruction so this fresh water here condenses and fresh water fresh water fresh water this coming 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 and going from this side okay to the production pipe so this fresh water this side there will be fresh water and other side there will be sea water correct ah sorry jacket water no sorry sea water obviously sea water sorry sea water and there will be fresh water see here sea water sea water coming and here sea water going and this is the last this is the last plate you see gasket arrangement now i will tell you gasket arrangement so you are confused with this you see this part this is your last plate okay and this alternate kv kd alternate and this one your first plate you see there is a full gasket obviously we don't want any leakage between gasket between this plate and this plate directly touching your fresh water body fresh water generator body so there is full gasket and after this sea water coming you see and going from this side okay you see flow also mentioned and from here fresh water coming you see with flow going from this side and at last obviously there is a close so it will follow this path okay see water coming and going from this side so you see gasket arrangement here there is no gasket obviously because there is a fresh water production side then on top fresh water coming by condensing okay then here sea water going and there should not be any mix up so see sea water only coming from this side and this side so this area for sea water and this area full fresh water okay so by knowing concept we can easily put kd kv kd kv no problem in that this one is your condenser this one is your evaporator plate see this is the first plate full gasket is there now one most important part see if you put plate in the correct manner definitely there will be formation of honeycomb type of structure you see and if there is no formation and if you did not put sorry and if you did not put in the correct manner you see the structure there is no formation you see there is overlap overlap of plates so you can easily identify i am putting this plate in the other way direction means something is wrong you have to be very careful while putting plates N never messed up with the plates always put in the correct direction in the correct way don't we put other way round if you know concept you never put other way round okay so now i'll discuss this evaporator part you see evaporator part you see over here there is a one small hole if you find small hole this definitely belongs to evaporator plate so you can never interchange evaporator and condenser plate i have seen people interchange but that's very bad it's never happened but it should never happen to anyone okay 
so you see this one is hole why this hole is there for feed water this from here sea water will enter you see sea water enters you see this lower part you see i taken i have taken this front view this jacket inlet outlet jacket inlet outlet from here full this area jacket this is this, this sea water you see sea water enters from here and from here also sea water going now i will take you to manual you see this plate ev is the plate you see diameter 5 mm it's showing in the manual in manual everything is written if you have doubt follow manual a little bit use common sense you see five mm diameter here there is a no gasket obviously there will be no gasket that's why see water feed water enters from here and then going over here this part ed part and then from here evaporates sea water evaporates that's why here no gasket you see you see arrangement this plate top side have no gasket why you see because the sea water enters and over this area the sea water obviously feed water evaporates why because temperature difference because there is a jacket water on the other side here there is a jacket water correct every alternate plate jacket water so evaporates from here evaporates and going to demister you see gasket arrangement like this like this you compare then uh, condenser plate and evaporator plate you see top part nothing have top part nothing have but see here there is a one fresh water production line and see here there is nothing full gasket so by looking at plate you can easily say that this one is condenser plate this one is evaporator plate okay so never messed up my main motto for making this video is only this one plate arrangement okay explanation i will tell you later how how does it work means there are many parts inductor part feed water part how vacuum creation this other part but basically we are dealing with the plates now okay you see carefully this plate arrangement if you put other way side other way side this side you change the side then it will not work you see so you have to follow this path i hope this is clear and and if you have any doubt then ask definitely okay thank you very much